Hello and welcome back to Subsistence. Right, back in my latest Let's Play season. Just getting used to where everything is in the uh, storage crates. A um, bit different from my uh, season 3 mansion. This, uh, this little small building on the beach. Uh, but yeah, we're getting ready to craft the recurve bow. Um, I've had the generators running for a little while. I've um, recycled some nails to get me the 50 mass that I needed um, over the standard 100 that the BCU generates for you. Um, we needed 1700 power to craft the bow. I only had 1500 um, capacity so I, I did have to manufacture a another um, power storage unit which took some power and mass and some materials um, but I've got that built and it's over here in the corner of the power storage cupboard so that's pretty good at least we've got that out of the way I think I've got that switched off at the moment just to uh, just to save power um, so we need this up to 1700. It's in here, isn't it? There we go. Recurve bow, 1700 we need. We've got everything else. Um, we've got three ingots and the scrap and whatever else it was. Got to keep going into the BCU. Weapon parts for some... Yeah, weapon parts make sense, I suppose, actually, yeah. Yeah, okay, so we've got sort of 500 odd power left to uh, to generate. Let's see how full the... Yeah, the fuel's fine in there. Okay, good. Oh, gosh, it's morning. And we've got some rogues. Aha, okay. Rogues across the beach. Interesting. Very interesting. Is that a moose or a deer? That's a deer, I think, the way it's walking. We're going to have some weather today, I'm afraid. Looks uh, a bit miserable out there at the moment. I'm kind of keeping my ears open for the sound of swimming hunters or little footsteps. Yeah, all the rogues are awake now. Look, they're all wandering around on the shore. It'd be nice to see them actually put down some bedrolls, wouldn't it? I think that would be kind of kind of cool or even if they just lay some bedrolls around the fire um, just for a bit of scenery that'd be kind of interesting right let's uh, go and have a look at what our other hunters are doing see if we've got anybody else on the way so we've got a few plants and a few wolves and things scrap all the usual and here comes the rain okay yeah it doesn't look like there's much movement going on over there we do have a wolf over there oh what's that in the water is that a deer that's a deer swimming towards us i think let's have a quick look what are you doing yeah, that's a deer. Just wondered if it might be a moose. Okay. So, hmm. What to do today? It's a matter of really waiting for that power to generate up. Let's shut the door. I can see a couple of... Um, weapon crates down there that I'd like to go and get. Actually, let's turn that light off because that is using up some of this power that's been generated. Not a lot, but every little helps. And we'll get us to our goal much quicker if we, uh, we save all the power we can. Okay, let's see if we can get these two crates without... Yeah, I think we should be fine. Is that a moose behind the... I'm imagining moose everywhere now. Um, gosh, right, okay. That bear might come this way, so I'll be ready to run. 
Ah, we're good. Yeah, I think I'm imagining moose everywhere, unfortunately. Let's have a little look over here again. Either that or that was a chicken with a moose hat on. Right, um, hmm. So I'm just trying to think where would be a good place to go and do a little bit of looting. That means we'll be quite close to home in case we get an attack. But we'll also be kind of, you know, fruitful. Oh gosh, that was a terrible shot. There we go. Where did he go? <laughs> he didn't go very far. Okay. Should have run a bit further, rabbit. Of course, that could be another rabbit. Right. Well, at the moment, <laughs> look at the look at the rogues on the um, sitting on the beach around their campfire. That looks fun actually, doesn't it? I wish we could sit down on the ground. You can see their pink bodies <laughs> reflected. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to think of what might be the best thing to do. Um, let's cook this rabbit. A little bit of protein. Um, we'll have the berry you and you away and um, we've always got a little bit of room for nails cloth uh, hmm. yeah we are kind of running out of storage but I really don't want to make another chest all right we need 1700 I think if I remember correctly So we're nearly at 15. It's not that far away. I'm kind of tempted to just hang around here for a little bit. Let's grab the weapon parts. Was it 15? Uh, I don't know why I thought it might be 15. Let's have a look. Yeah, and five boards. Right, okay. Whoops. I might make some more boards actually. We always need them. There we go. I'll drop that in there and we'll eat you. Right, okay. Let's have a look at the plants because they have to be ready now, surely. No, not quite. Almost. But they don't need food or water, so that's good. Hmm. Okay. Right, so how are, we, uh, how are we doing off for food? We've got quite a few steaks. We've got a couple of uh, liver, liver and onions. Tasty mix of protein and vegetables. Gives us quite a good um, health and stamina boost, that does. Um, so that's really all we can make because we need steak and eggs is the other good meal. So really hash browns we could do potato and onions but I can't imagine them being very good I don't have the boiling pan and I don't have the baking pan yet and that baking pan is really expensive I think it's like eight ingots yeah eight ingots adhesive uh, funnily enough is um, pretty manageable but look we need 250 mass so I'm gonna need another mass storage so that's something to bear in mind. Um, 1700, nearly 1600, that's not too bad. Okay, I'm going to go and have a look from up on the uh, top deck. I haven't been up there for a while. I can get up there without bumping into every surface on the way. Try not to jump off the roof either. Oh look, they're going off on a on an adventure. Cool. Can't see anything going on at Charlie. 
can't see Bravo from here. Um, Alpha's kind of in between these trees. Yeah, they're sort of hanging around the base. We do need to go one more floor up, I think. I think that will get us just away from these trees that make it so difficult. There we go. We can see their base there through the trees and there's the fire. Any moose around? They're pretty easy to see across the map, which is kind of interesting. No, not seeing anything. Cool. So, 81% light on the um, solar panels. We do need to upgrade them all at some point. And this is uh, fully upgraded and generating <laughs> 0 0.01 power. Hardly anything, really. Okay, that's fine. Right, let's go and have a look. See if the power is uh, at the right levels. There's my lovely sofa. I do like the design of the stairs like that. Yeah, 1700 power just. So we're going to need the generator to carry on running to keep the fridge going. Recurve bow. Am I happy to do this now? It's going to leave us really low on power. Oh my god, look at all that power. Oh my gosh, down to... Whoa, why is it tanking? Oh my gosh. Right down to 50. That's terrible, isn't it? Okay, great. <clears throat> so, let's have a look at this on the workbench then. Look at that. That looks awesome, doesn't it? Let's turn that light on. That looks really good. Very, very nice. Let's put that away. We'll use that as our screenshot today. Something like um, that, maybe? Yep. Very cool. Could put the big um, vice in the uh, shot as well. I do like the detail on the workbench. It's kind of nice. Get one from the other angle as well. Okay, let's grab that then. So that is now going to give us... Uh, it's a more agile and powerful bow. Wood, wooden arrows have a greater chance of breakage, um, but not premium arrows. Premium arrows should have the same chance of breaking. Uh, zero chance of breaking, maybe, or maybe the same chance as what they used to have. I do have three premium arrows that are looted from somewhere. Okay, so that was the goal for today, um, just to get that crafted. Um, we do need to sort out our garden. So we need, we've got three spots available. Let's go and see what seeds we have. I'd like to put some more onions in if I'm honest. Yeah, let's get some more onions. Um, we're going to have to uh, extract some, I think. But for each seed planted, I think we get three onion plants, ba uh, onions back. So we should have uh, nine onions from those three seeds, I think. Okay, good. Right, that's awesome. And we've got plenty of arrows on us. Um, food and... Food and... F food, fruits and vegetables. We're not doing too badly. Um, I suppose I could have... Maybe a protein bar. A couple of berries and a water. Yeah, good. Okay. Good. Right, let's see how this looks. Let's get the uh, house in the background, shall we? 
Oh, it looks really cool. Very nice. I like that. Me with my hunter jacket on. Yeah, <laughs> that's awesome. Right, okay. Now, um, rogues over there. We have Bravo trying to come fishing this way. Fully geared up as well. Who goes fishing in riot gear, quite honestly? I suppose it depends what you're fishing with. Let's go and have a look at Alpha. I'm convinced they're going to come over soon. It'd be nice to be kind of prepared and to limit any damage. So we've got a bear just next to us here. Yeah. No, then they're, they're not doing anything in particular, are they? <laughs> Just walking around in the river. Um, where should we loop? It seems it's a bit odd today. We haven't really had a sort of a standard day. It's been milling around the base uh, in order to get all that power and stuff sorted out. Actually, you know what, we'll just really quickly check. I've got enough uh, biofuel in the generator just to get this power back up because oh, we really let it go. No, it's very low. Let's get a bunch, get that topped up and we can just leave it running there of course because it will shut off automatically once it's reached capacity. We're, we're back up to 500 anyway, needing the worried. Okay, good. Well, let's make the best of the rest of this day. We can't go that way because that guy was sort of hanging around fishing. Um, I think straight up here looks like our best option at the moment. I want to be fairly close to the base for the end of the day just because I expect us to get an attack. <clears throat> right, I need all these berries. I wish we could grow berries in the plant beds. I would like that very much. Seems strange that we can grow everything else, but not the berries. I suppose berries are found out in the wild. Oh gosh. Right, can we afford to make a lot? and get back here in time. Yeah, I could recycle some nails I suppose for the mass. I think I remember where that was so uh, we'll get back up there as soon as we can. We know the power is back up to where we need it to be, but once I start recycling stuff, it's going to be a bit of a different proposition, isn't it? 600, yeah, this might use up. I need 75, okay. So it's on 30 now. I don't need 91, that's for sure. Let's try that. Uh, that'll be 57. Blah. Let's see. I think it tells me in there anyway, doesn't it? 54. <laughs> I need 75. Right, okay. Um, oh, come on. Nice, okay. And we're just above the 500. And then we will need two boards and four scrap and some iron. I suppose it will be a good finish to the day to be able to go and get this and then get back. Let's hope there's something good in there. Let's put the uh, ammo away. Up to 41. 
That's pretty, yeah, that's pretty good, isn't it, really? I think we might take that out with us. I don't think I would need that much um, ammo, actually. Um, let's swap that with that and do that sort of thing. Right, we've got the power generation going. We've got the lock pick. Yeah, okay. Let's get up there. Let's see if we can grab this uh, lock crate. Nice. Kind of unexpected. So I think I went pretty much straight up, if I remember. Oh gosh. I don't really want him following me if I'm going to go and open a lock crate. Yeah, it was just by these rocks, wasn't it? There we go. Alright, let's turn around and make sure we're okay. Yep, we're good. Nice. Iron. And a bit of ammo. And some medicinal tonic. You know what? That's not bad. I'm quite happy with that. Alright, let's sort of do a bit of light looting around the... Uh, Around these hills here. <laughs> that was a wolf dropping in over there, did you see? You just see them dropping in from the sky. <laughs> well, not quite not quite the sky, just above the ground. No wonder they're always angry. Oh gosh, there's a bear. Oh, and there's a nice piece of iron there I could have had if I was paying, paying a bit more attention. Yeah, we better not go and stop there until we know that bear has moved along. All right, just making sure there are no rogues and we'll get this crate down here. And we'll try, if we can, to go back and get that bit of iron, but I think that bear's still a little bit too close. Maybe we'll be okay. <sighs> Is it worth it for a little bit of zinc? Is it? <laughs> That's a lot of creeping around for a little bit of zinc. Well, I'm committed now. Let's quietly go down here and we'll get this crate as well. Oh yeah, that wasn't bad, was it? Nice. Right, get the recurve bow back out. It does equip nice and quickly. Um, we can think about upgrading this soon as well. And that will give us a little bit more bang for our buck when it comes to going after a moose or a bear or whatever. Haha, <laughs> the bear and the... Um, the wolf are having a bit of a power there, I think. That was funny. So I want to get this all squirreled away back in the base, nice and safe. I don't think we've got any sinew in that one, but the iron was very good. And there was a bit of uh, decent ammo, I think. And the plates are quite welcome. They're quite expensive to make when you need a lot of them. Okay, that's looking good. Let's just have a look over this side again. Yeah, it's a bit odd really to sort of spend all of the day quite so close to the base. But a couple of crates over there. I wonder if it's just worth wandering around the beach here. We can get across with it. I go in that bear. There's two crates for the picking. What we don't want to happen is a hunter to turn up behind us to go fishing and uh, spot us and think it's a, an aggressor. Okay, good. Right, we've got a wolf there. Let's run back this way. Um, there's an onion there I'd like. You know what, I'm going to run for it. 
That was dangerous. You know why? I could have broken my leg then. <laughs> oh no, everything's chasing me. Wow. Yeah, that's a bear and a wolf. Both of them have dropped off now, I think. I'm not unhappy about that, actually, because if we do... Well, they've all stayed over there. If we do get a couple of hunters arriving for a late night raid, they're going to have a bit of a shock, aren't they? Look at them all over there, sunning themselves on the beach. There's a deer. Yeah, they get, there's going to be a few animals hanging around the base, but the thing is they didn't come far enough, did they? Let's have another look over this way. Okay. We've got the end of the day light. Lovely evening sun. So, let's see. Can we get a nice shot of you? My arm. There's a funny thing with her arm. I'm going to hide her arm. There we go. Get the rogues in the background. <laughs> oh, there's there's a deer um, drinking in the uh, in the lake, uh, the uh, river there. A couple of angry hunters, and um, and the one hunter that's in his camp. If I just point him out, he's just leaning alongside the railing there. I think he was watching the deer for a few minutes. I wonder how far this arrow would go. Oh, it's get. Well, oh no, that was a bit silly of me, wasn't it? That's an act of aggression. That was onto their territory. I wonder if they're going to come over now. Um. Okay, I, I I did that. That that was that was my fault. Oops. Um. Sorry about that, guys. God damn it. <laughs> oh jeez, that was funny. I've got a lot crate on me. I can't afford to die. Jeez. They're gonna come over here all explodey. Here they are. Come on, bear. Come on, bear. Get him. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. Fell down the stairs. Oh, you, sh you should be going after the hunters. Come on. Get the hunters. Yeah. That's hardly fair, really. Oh, my shooting's not very good today. Okay. Oh my gosh, that was rude. And then they're hiding down here and I can't see them. Okay, we've got one down. Let's have a bandage. Wow, my um, my aim is not great today. Right, that's two down. Is that all that's left? I thought there was another one out here somewhere. Oh, there's a deer. Ha! So, did a hunter get attacked by a bear? Is that what happened? Maybe. Oh, get in. Oh my gosh. Okay, we've got some good food now at least. Right, let's get these arrows before they disappear because they're, you know, arrows. And let's get... No, we're going to need you. Where's your bag? Okay. 
there is another one somewhere here. That's two. Where was the third guy? Did he escape? It must have been uh, killed by a bear. Must have been. Very interesting. Okay. Very nice. And um, we've got a liver. What is that? Cloth. Um, let's wash ourselves. Okay. And that was totally my own fault. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, okay, we're going to need the liver for liver and onions, so drop those in there and we'll come back and cook something a bit later. Um, yeah, let's get this stuff away. That probably wasn't the best thing to do, to fight them. Let's put everything away. I think most things go in the other crate, don't they? That's the trouble. Um, cloth. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so... I think I've got a tiny bit of space for overflow. Yeah, not much though. Nails, some more plates. Um, let's make another fuel brick. Always making fuel bricks just lately. Uh, a little bit more ammo. I'll recycle those. Uh, I think I'll recycle that as well. Okay, good. So let's uh, get that on to refine. We've got 974 power. I think we're going to afford to turn that on now. Yeah, I'm just going to dump those in there. That's cool. Right, okay. Let's have something to eat. So we've got liver and onions here prepared. Grab some water. Let's uh, do the plants. I think we have probably some cotton to... No, we already, we already grabbed the cotton. Well, at least the bear took care of one of the hunters. I do think that AI, that AI could be slightly improved. Um, I know we can't have the animals killing every hunter on the map, otherwise, otherwise there wouldn't be any challenge for us. But I think when they're coming running through and there is an animal directly in their path like that, they should have to try and engage it or path around. I think that would probably be fair. Uh, but that was fun. Yeah. So we've got the, um, the recurve bow crafted. And uh, yeah, it looks really, really nice. Well, that's a really good close-up picture. Actually, that's quite nice with the fire. Yeah, good. I'll, uh, I'll grab a picture there. Can we get one from the other side? Not so easily, but... Yeah, good. So Rico Boat is crafted. That was quite... Um, quite a, a challenge actually. The uh, the power requirements were quite surprising on that. I didn't realise um, it would need another power storage so it's uh, it's good. Uh, the next thing we probably should think about is a, a baking pan. Uh, we're going to need eight metal ingots and the reason I want to get that is for um, the... in fact we could probably just about make those eight metal ingots now. I want to get that for cooking the ribs um, from the moose because uh, I've been quite uh, enjoying doing that in my um, in the last season base, and they give you a whole bunch of um, nutrition, so pretty good. But I think that's where I'm going to leave this one. So I accidentally annoyed Alpha, <laughs> even though I was only really shooting at the uh, the deer across the water. Um, Managed to uh, to annoy them. I've done, got a bit of damage to repair on the base, so I'll get that crafted. I'll get that uh, repaired before I uh, log out. But I think that's going to be it for this one. Um, 
next time round we'll either upgrade the up uh, the recurve bow or we'll try and work towards uh, getting that baking pan. Um, we need to think about making the flashlight, which is another thing we uh, we need to work on. Um, for the flashlight, is that in the workbench as well? Flashlight. That's a lot cheaper, but it still needs two metal ingots, so at the very least we're going to need two. Let's get those crafted now while I think about it. Yeah. And then we've got them for next time if that's what we decide to do. But for now, thank you so much for joining me. Until next time, take care and I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.